and we are once again with my hero ultra impact okay so today we are here continuing the case two of the special cases tv anime six season retrospective so this should conclude the war arc or maybe the entirety of the sixth season so I guess I gotta go to chapter two. Special case two, TV anime six season retrospective part uh, 105, I think. The battle between the paranormal liberation front and the heroes is heating up. In order to stop the finally awakened Tomura Shigaraki, the heroes team up to take him on. The whole lab should have fallen under decay. Why are the Nomus here? I can control decay now. I tried not to let it spread to the Nomu capsules, but I couldn't save all of them. Shigaraki repels the hero's attacks and notices Eraserhead, thwarting his efforts from afar. If you can see me, then you should consider that I can see you. Shigaraki heads towards Eraserhead to eliminate this obstacle. Yeah. You're in the way, Eraserhead. The one in the way is you. One for all. If Shigaraki can't use his quirk, then let us fight, too! The worst that could happen to us is for us to lose Mr. Aizawa. He's protected us this whole time. Armor-piercing machine gun! Mm. Deku, Bakugo, there's nothing we can do about you two being here now. I won't ask why you're here for now. Support Eraser, Bakugo, protect Deku. If I can snatch Izuku Midoriya and leave this place. One for all, become mine, little brother. The heroes launch a simultaneous attack to stop Shigaraki, who has his sights set on Deku. That guy's bait! Smash! Vanishing Fist! The heroes continue to fight with everything they have to stop Tomura Shigaraki. Meanwhile, at Gunga Mountain Villa. You can do it! Don't let him out push you, Mount Lady! You don't have to tell me that! I won't let you go that way! I've been waiting for you, Master. I'll go to you now. It's possible that the Jaku team failed. If that guy gets down to the city, it'll be an unprecedented disaster. We won't be able to stop him with strength. Bring me to his face. Roger, what? The League is on his back! Damn it! A quirk that can stop that. Majestic. No, it's too big for him. We couldn't do anything. Can you hear me? Create she. Wow, I forgot that was Momo's hero name. No one can stop him with brute force. I want to put him to sleep. 
Make anesthetics to give to the heroes. Then get out of there. If that's too hard, then evacuate right away. I leave it to your judgment. What do you do, Momo Yao? Earphone jack. Tentacool. You sound to see how far he is and how long it'll take him to get here. Get a rough estimate of the giant's size from your visuals. We will all confront him here. I would like to attempt to oral administration. This jar contains an effective dose of undiluted solution. We'll make a quick trap and stop that large villain in his tracks. He's here, right in front of me. Exactly where we want him. He's in the trap. The student strategy went well. However, there was one unexpected element. His otherworldly specs as an organism that could blow away everything with a single breath. Wah! We can't get close because of the flames. Not yet. If we get him buried deeper, then we still have a chance. Wah! Open wide. Come on. Open up. If there's a way to stop this guy right now. I believe in you. All you UA fledglings. Max Visocity. Acid Man. With this viscous armor, the fire won't be able to get me. Those of us who can get through this have to go. Melt your hearts that's frozen with fear and go. Wasting time on those flies cost me time. Driving them off so they can't swarm me again is now the shortest route. Ah! That was so scary! This voice, from back then. Ugh! Ashido, I'll carry on. Your chivalrous spirit! Red Riot got him to take a dose! Kirishima did it! Yeah, man. What a callback. I didn't know that guy was ever going to be a villain in this. Like, seeing Kirishima and Ashido's flashback to this guy back when he was normal, quote-unquote. Or maybe barely being experimented by All for One. When he was just like giants. And then finally seeing Kirishima and Mina both deal with him in the future now that they're heroes. Was kind of a super cool moment. But. Determination and willpower brought forth results as their wish came true. It's over, Tomura Shigaraki. Well, I guess we have to see what the result is after, but I mean, I completely finished season six and holy, I was not expecting what happens to them. No matter how powerful you get, we will not yield to a destruction without conviction. I have conviction. I had it. Everything that I've seen, everything you've all built, rejected me. That's why I'll reject you too. That's why I destroy. That's why I become stronger. 
Man, I did not see all these heroes when I originally went through this season. Some of these heroes actually look kind of neat. Like that girl with power armor. Uh, I don't know what the guy in the background is, but... Yeah, these are some interesting hero designs. You don't have to understand. It's because you don't understand that we have heroes and villains. Ryuk! Man, I swear I hate saying this hero's name so much. It just tongue ties me every time I try and say it. Shigaraki! You are the only one I won't forgive! Turn anger into power! Bind him! Black Whip! Muster your strength. These guys don't know I have this yet. In Shigaraki's clenched hand lay the red bullet that had once stolen Mirio's quirk. A deleter round! Don't let him fire it! Don't let him fire it! One for all! A hundred percent! Wyoming smash! Right now, I feel like I can stand up to any difficulties, as long as I have my dreams and my origin in my heart. Yeah, this was so metal of him to catch Midoriya's arm with his teeth. But damn, his teeth probably got all busted up like that. Like, that's probably what caused the cracks, or maybe just his beating beforehand. Mr. Aizawa! Thanks, Ryuk. Now, I won't hesitate. I'll be rational to do what I must. Damn, so it's three battles, so we'll have to see how well that is. But I'm pretty sure there was a few things there that they didn't show. Okay, increase speed for all allies. Increase max HP 20% for three turns. Well, let's see the other one. Decrease power of all opponents by 20% for three turns and decrease their speed. Uh, let's go with the top one. Going back to blue. But, oh damn, he is actually pretty giant. I think this is the first time we're fighting him in this game. Damn, he could be a raid boss battle or something. And, like, his little Simbo is so big as well. But, yeah, playing this, like, after watching the season, man, it's such a night and day difference between seeing, like, the anime stills, like, in this context, and actually seeing them in the anime itself because there's something Shigaraki was doing to prepare for the shot which I don't think they wanted to show because it's technically too gory if I'm not mistaken <laughs> damn he's completely stunned wait what did Bakugo's move even happen did just skip the animation like, he's just completely stunned. Oh, damn. I wonder if he's going to transform into that other form. But yeah, I'm guessing most of the people have probably already watched this. I would imagine most My Hero fans are up to date on Season 7.
Okay, so we have to fight Mount Lady too. Dang. Uh, decrease. Hold on, I want to change this team, I'm pretty sure, right? How, how do I edit a team? <laughs> I completely forgot. How do you edit? Alright, well, I kind of fixed my teams, and so I'm going to just at least throw a couple of teams at this, and hopefully we're able to win, but we'll see. Oh man, I can't believe I messed up all my teams like that, so I'm going to have to work through this again. Mount Lady. Well, can at least take her out the other teams will have at least a somewhat easier time damn they take out all of them damn okay well well let's just throw everything we have at them Both of them attack her. Okay, good. At least her taken care of. Damn, and never stunned. Oh yeah, what I forgot to mention before I messed up my teams was, yeah, it was kind of brutal to see how Shigaraki fired off the shot. Since he has such insane strength, I'm pretty sure, like, he was kind of ripping up, like, Ryuk's arm to fire off that shot. So, so it's like he made a hole in her arm slash hand area so he could fire off that shot. Okay, are we going to win? No, my healer. Okay, let's see. No, Deku, you bastard. So close. I hate it here. If I would have just got that off. Alright, let's try this other team. See how well this works. Hopefully I can win. Alright, yeah, we're winning. Oh my god, I can't believe I had to waste the slot. I was so close. How many more slots do I even have? Like two, three? What is it? Oh, damn it! N now I need to use. No! No! I used most of my reds! Oh my god, and I only have two. I hate it here. Okay. 
Oh, you love to see that. So I'll use plus ultra. Stand by, stand by. Can at least get one of them. I think my other team can win. Okay, good, the healing. Motherfucker in your counters. Damn it. Uh, but I think we can. Two of them are super close to being taken out. I really do hate this talking between them. Like, what? Why does the talking take so long? Don't, don't take out my one for all. I need him. Okay, good. I think we got her. You're done, Momo Yao. Took out my all for one, but now you're dead. We decayed you. Who lucky? <laughs> Barely. Alright, we can finally do the next story. Special Case 2 TV Anime 6 Season Retrospective. Man, you really are cool, Eraser. But even so, for an instant, you were distracted. <laughs> this damn game is finally about to end. Alright, so that is super interesting. Since a few of the times I was playing this game, my memory to the actual scene in the anime and how this game does it was so different because I didn't notice how they were censoring everything. Like the Miriko stuff seems like it wasn't being censored too bad. I think it kind of showed her missing her limbs and stuff. But for this, they didn't show Eraser cutting off his leg. And they didn't show that Shigaraki kind of broke through Ryuk's hand slash arm just to fire off that shot. The heroes are forced on the defensive. 
and other battles as well. In the urban district, for those living in the following areas, please begin evacuating immediately. I repeat. Currently, a giant villain is moving north from Mount Gunga in Wayakama to Jaku City in Kyoto. He'll destroy all those cities? The rescue facility for injured heroes. What was that? Was destroyed by a monster called Giganto Machia. Yeah, man, that form is so awesome. I really wish he would have used it much sooner. But I'm guessing that's a power-up form he can only do for a limited time. Or he really doesn't like using this form. I guess they didn't want to show the results of right after what happened with the UA heroes and stuff like that. Because I, I think they really want you to watch the anime so they take away chunks of the story. So then you want to go and watch the anime. But yeah, right after they threw the medicine inside his mouth, they were like, yeah, we win. But it's like the medicine wasn't taking effect because this guy is so big or at least so resistant with his willpower that it's not affecting him. Hey, should the aesthetics have taken effect by now? Shroom. Okay, so no, I guess they are going to show it, but for whatever reason, they were showing a flash forward to him destroying the city. Hey, is it this bad? Weren't we checkmate from the start? Yeah. Now, die. Huh? Gran Torino said all for one's quirks were transplanted into Shigaraki. He's like me, the vessel for the great amount of power. His body isn't strong enough. Oh well, super recovery is gone. It's over once I touch this. One for all, the seven users float. I'll stop you here with everything I have. One for all is a power that's been passed down to defeat all for one. I have to use everything from one for all, no matter what happens to me. This power is keeping me from realizing my dreams. That's what this power is for. At this rate, he'll lose. Todoroki, grab hold of me. Endeavor, I'll use my heat. In all the information about the successors that All Might collected, only the records of the fourth were incomplete. All Might realized something. He held it back because he wasn't certain. At the root of it, Deku doesn't think about himself. That's always felt weird to me and made me want to stay away from him. But I couldn't understand my own weakness, so I put those thoughts aside and bullied him. <laughs> it's like you want to leave a weird person and not interact with them at all. But instead, you tell yourself, nah, I do want to interact with them. But instead, I'll bully him. Deku and One For All are both incomprehensible, unpredictable. Even if One For All is a cursed power. One For All is... Now! Bastard! 
plus ultra prominence burn. Yeah, this was a pretty cool move, but I guess they really didn't show it that much in trying to show how they did it. I'm pretty sure to Todoroki helped them get up, and then once they were a certain distance up, then Bakugo was the one blasting himself and Endeavor up. And then he launched Endeavor into the sky, straight into Shigaraki for this move, so then he could do the prominence burn. Since Endeavor couldn't fly anymore, or was too injured to do that. Tomura. Lend me your body, Tomura. Why aren't you dead? In that instance, I didn't think. My body just moved on its own. Don't try to win by yourself. Kachan! I finally touched you. I'll take it now. One for all. At last, the two quarks finally meet. Good. Tomra, your hatred is getting through. One for all can only move by the will of its owner as a rule. But your anger is starting to encroach it. We won't go over there. We have chosen to be inside this boy. Yeah, they are really speed running through this kind of battle between all for one and one for all. A boy is so obsessed with saving others that he's deviated from the norm. We will stay with him. And man, he got so mad at Shigaraki, like, in this instance. I forgot what the reason was, but yeah, he was just like, Shigaraki! And wanted to take him down. It wasn't stolen, but... Shigaraki, please, stay down! The battle with Shigaraki did not end there. Indeed, it only grew in scale. I got a visual on Tomura Shigaraki with a camera. He's fighting Endeavor. Yes. Endeavor? That's good. Get ready. Toga, -chan. Toga, you okay with this? Those are the UA students you like. They're heroes, too. What line do you have to cross to become a hero? If heroes killed Jin, then will they kill me too? He's already covered that distance? You two, over there! Help me! Froppy, you take those two somewhere safe. Save as many as possible! Don't worry, I'll definitely save him. Yeah, even these smaller scenes, they're kind of fast-forwarding through. Where the lady didn't even mention, Oh, my husband was is trapped in our house, or something like that. And he needs help. Can you two help me? And so they're fast-forwarding the scenes, too, of where... Urak is trying to chase this lady and see where. But it's like... Damn, this lady is actually pretty fast. I wonder why she's so fast. <laughs> really? And then here's why she's so fast. Because it's actually Toga. Himiko! Toga! Long time no see, Ochako. Too bad. 
I wanted to talk to Tetsu too. So tell me, Ochako, what do you want to do to me? Do you want to kill me like Jin was killed? Am I going to be killed, Ochako? What do you want to do to me? You came here just to ask that? Just Right now, I want to save as many people as possible if you're going to get in my way, then I'll catch you right now When I think about someone I love it makes me want to become that person But not everyone is like that it makes it very hard to live Himiko Toga, if you're going to live as you like and threaten people, then you need to accept the responsibility for your actions. Yeah, you're right. Huh? Thanks. Bye-bye. The battles waged in different locations come to a head in a decisive battle. Near Shigaraki, in the ruins of Jakku General Hospital. Man, I barely beat it with my six lives. Yeah, that was an intense battle, just like the battle with the paranormal war, or whatever they like to call this arc. Like, I lost everyone just to barely win. Just kind of like the heroes are doing now. But yeah, that is interesting to see how much they fast forward through stuff and how much stuff is censored. Because you're not going to know that Aizawa lost an eye there when Shigaraki was doing that hand plant thing on him. I think crushed one of his eyes and that he cut off his own leg so yeah seeing the sensor like in this game but this game isn't completely censored so they show some stuff but all right I think that's where I'll call it here for today yeah we will have to finish the other two sessions and hopefully I won't nearly lose but yeah, anyway, I hope you guys are enjoying My Hero Ultra Impact Case Files TV Anime 6 Season Retrospective. If you guys are, please make sure to follow me on all my social medias, like my Twitter, my Twitch, my YouTube, my DLive, my TikTok, my Kick, Rumble, Odyssey, and Daily Motion. Check out my second YouTube channel and like and comment on all my videos, and even join my Discord. There you can stay up to date with everything I choose to do, or my streams, videos, or anything else. We hope to see you guys next time. Bye.